Hey, what's up guys? Big Wolf back here again with another tip. I put out a uh, hand wrap video a few months back and some people like it, some people didn't like it. I uh, just wanted to uh, maybe give you guys another option for your hand wrapping, maybe like an easier option. If the one was maybe a little bit more difficult, maybe not, I don't know. But uh, got some twins wraps here, nice and long. I think they're about 180 centimeters, maybe more. You want to get a nice long hand wrap. Uh, either like a Mexican style or like a Thai style, it's like 180 or 210, somewhere in between there, centimeters. So what I'm going to do, the first thing I'm going to do is, get, get focus on my hand here, I'm going to get my thumb loop on uh, my thumb. If you want to make sure your stitching is down, then I'll make sure when you're done that the uh, Velcro is on the right side. So I'm going to go thumb, stitching down, I'm going to go around the wrist. Probably you guys can see this around the wrist. Once, twice. I'm going to go around from my wrist, my pinky towards my index finger, around the palm, back of the knuckle. When I go back around again, I'm going to go from my pinky back down towards my opposite side of my wrist, making kind of like a little X there. Yeah, a little X there. Go back around the wrist here. Now I'm going to go up in between my pinky. Back down from the pinky to my wrist. Turn the wrist, go back up, move on to the next finger. In between my middle and my uh, ring finger, on the outside of the ring and the pinky, back down to the wrist. Sometimes your material will get bunched up a little bit. No big deal, just flatten it back out. Back down around the wrist, from the wrist, back up again, between your index finger and your middle finger, back between your middle finger and your ring finger, back down, around the wrist, last time, last time I'm going to go from my uh, index finger, to my pointer or whatever, to my middle finger, back down, to the wrist, now I'm going to go I'll get it snug. Now I'm going to go to the back, my palm, back around again, pulling it snugly, back down again towards the wrist, and finally ending it down there. I uh, personally don't really like the thumb loop thing, so usually when I'm done, I'll just take that off and tuck that in. So now I've got a nice, uh, a, not, a not very stuffy palm. Webbing in between my fingers is good, so none of this padding up here is going to slide. I was pulling it snug while I went around. I've got some good cross support and a lot of, a lot of wrist support um, for your wrist or whatnot. So uh, that's just another way you can do it. You can wrap your hands about a thousand different ways, but I've got two now that I've showed you. So one and the other. So hopefully you guys can figure out which one you like. Try them both out, and uh, when you get comfortable, experiment. Try it out on your own. Uh, do the important things, the wrist, the cross support, the knuckle support, and uh, figure out what you like and what works for you. So uh, from Big Will here, let's go with Will.com.